With many people stuck at home, roads across the state are seeing less congestion than ever before, but that wide open space is leading to another issue. 22 News State House reporter Jody Reed joins us live from Boston and Jody. We've been sifting through startling new data from MassDOT. Last month, the number of deadly crashes doubled here in the Commonwealth, even with 50% less traffic recorded on our major highways. Mass DOT reported that 28 people died behind the wheel last month. They said the high death rate underscores the importance of not exceeding the posted speed limit, wearing a seatbelt, driving sober, and obeying the hands-free law. Mass DOT even initiated a new message board campaign along state highways, reminding drivers to keep a safe distance from other vehicles and to slow down. Massachusetts is famous for our congestion, so having the ability to drive a little bit faster is, is certainly something we're seeing people do with really deadly consequences. As a member of the Transportation Committee, Rep. Sabadosa and many of her colleagues spent months listening to the families of those killed by distracted drivers and reckless driving crashes. The hands-free law is in effect here in Massachusetts, and it's being enforced during this pandemic, just like every other traffic law that's been put in place to keep people safe. Working for you tonight in Boston, Jody Reed, 22 News.